second. Okay. Well, good evening, everyone. Um, like I said, we're opening our special board meeting today, um, Wednesday, April 9th, still the 14th, at 7 o'clock. A closed session at 7.06. I would like to reconvene to open session at 9.58. Regarding item 3B on the closed session agenda, the board has voted 5-0 to place the superintendent on paid administration leave pending a review and investigation by independent counsel or the appropriate agency. Thank you. Good evening. My name is Regina Snell and I'm a citizen of Concord. And you'll have to forgive me. I've got to read off notes since this is last minute. Um, and I have several questions for um, the board. And I want to know what was so urgent that you guys had to have a special meeting tonight with minimal notification to the public um, because you have a meeting scheduled on the 15th. You guys couldn't wait four days to have that meeting and you have a member who's already on vacation. You guys couldn't wait, really? And this way you would have had more public um, participation and it looks bad. It looks like you guys are sneaking around. You're trying to hide something. My name is Ina Wright-Wilson and now uh, Amanda is not here but I would like to uh, give him this question. He told us that the media was wrong, over separated his salary. So now I would like to have him that question. Was he lying? The media lying? Or this subject two form I have a copy of there that stated he got $663,365.98 in 2013. Who are you people? That's a good reason for you to get out of town. No ethics, no more. Yes, my name is David Nell, and I did place my sheet of paper up there. David, you're out of order. That's fine. I got three minutes. I filled out that paper. They're all no. Now, where are we going to go? Respect. Where are we? Respect is earned, not given. He's you have not earned any of our respect, and that is another example why. Is there a motion to approve the consent calendar? Why is there no motion? There's no motion. There's no motion. At this time, the consent calendar is approved. You're on video right now. Go to the consent calendar. 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 We just needed a closed the consent calendar. You may see David. You don't have to do that. You can, oh, you can do what you want. You're out of order, sir. David has the floor. You have a superintendent that you have given $910,000 to at 2% interest. How can this happen? This is ridiculous. You have students that don't have books. I don't care what happens. I have been handing out flyers. I'm going to do it again get people at this next meeting. And what's going to happen is I've been contacting bureaucracies. Other people are going to do it as well. We're going to get someone else in the bureaucracies that care what's going on in this district. And we are going to make sure that the district attorney or state attorney general is going to look into what's going on with the $600,000 package. This will not stand. And I expect that you guys are not going to give the superintendent a golden parachute. I am going to fight day after day to prevent a holding parachute for that man. I have a quote from the LA Times. It was an article, I believe, on March 31st. He, it says he, referring to Mr. Fernandez, cited the home purchase as an example of how he has been relatively restrained in using some perks in his contract, which I would, which would have allowed for larger loan purchase on a home in a more expensive area. Quote, I could have gone to Brentwood or Malibu if I wanted to abuse something. Apparently, this man that you are employing doesn't believe a zero down $910,000 loan is a big deal. We here believe that's a huge deal. And if you look at Bell, we believe that this is a, mil a misappropriation of public funds. And I believe the district attorney has got to know about that. In addition to that, you guys have not been earning $250 a month. 
that's going to be looked at as well. House so, number 41. I don't have I'll be in. Thank you. So I would like to adjourn this meeting at 1034.